All right, guys, good bit of chords in this one, but stay tuned. I'm going to teach you every chord, how to play every chord. And if you already know how to play the chord, just skip through it. But... Cause you love Radiohead just like me Cause you're a cool cat man And I hope one day You can rip the guitar up uh, So it all starts with an A minor right A minor is going to be middle finger on the 2nd fret D string Ring finger right under it on the G string Index finger on the 1st fret of the B string Next, you're going to go to a D with an F sharp root note, all right? So, regular D chord, right? You got your index on the G string second fret. That sounds kind of out of tune. Sorry if I'm out of tune, guys. I, I got, I got jujitsu soon. Uh, middle finger on second fret, high E. Ring finger on the third fret of the B, okay? And the F sharp right here on the second fret with your thumb, okay? So we got this E minor. That's on the A and D string of the second fret. To a G. Boom. Middle finger on the third fret. Top string. Index finger on the A string, second fret. Uh, ring finger on the high E, third fret. Okay? So that's the first line. going to be barring the whole first fret, ring finger on the A string, third fret, pinky right below it on the D string, middle finger on the second fret of the G string. That's your F, okay? Now it's going to go back to the E minor, to the G. Okay? So, if you noticed, it goes A minor, A minor changes to F instead of D, and then it goes to the E and G, like the first line, okay? So, real slow. E minor. Second, first two lines, down, all right? I'm gonna play it real slow again. Phrase, 
this phrase back to your A minor. Okay, this is going to be the third line. So this one's going to be A minor, D, and some kind of cool is going to happen now. It's going to go G, really cool. So what's happening is G, and you know how we did that D with the F sharp bass? This is pretty much going to be like a G, but the root note's going to be F sharp, okay? So all you do is play your regular G chord, right? And then you move this ring finger over to the second fret, aka F sharp, and now it's going to be a G, but with the F sharp bass. Okay, so G, F sharp, okay? Next chord is going to be C to C with a B bass. Okay, so all you're doing is regular C chord. I don't think I explained how to do a C chord yet. So uh, C chord is B, B string, first fret with your index finger. Uh, middle finger is going to be on the second fret of the D string. Ring finger is going to be on the third fret of the A string. Okay, so that's your C chord. All you do is uh, go C and then move this over to the second fret, and that's your B. B note, not B chord, that's a B note. Okay, so we got G, F sharp, C. Back to A minor. Really easy to switch to the A minor from there because all you're doing is taking this finger and moving it down to the uh, G string. All the other fingers are gonna be in the same place, okay? So. Buzz like a frigid D. G, F sharp, C, B, A minor. D minor, D. Okay, we'll get to that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna play everything from the top real slow, okay? To the next verse so uh all you need to know b minor b minor is barring the whole second fret ring finger on the fourth fret of the d string pinky on the g string fourth fret middle finger on the b string third fret sorry if i'm a little out of tune here guys I honestly i'm in a rush i've been working all day and i gotta go to jujitsu in like 10 minutes or so but um all right so let's do that uh g thing that little g walk down type thing it's real slow so y'all can get it your A minor and it's the same exact so I just taught you the whole verse okay every verse is gonna be that chord pattern all right so you pretty much got the hard part down A 
sharp seven really easy chord just bar the whole second fret ring finger is on the a string of the fourth fret okay so that's the whole chorus sharp seven G and instead of going to the F sharp seven on the last time it goes when you mess mess when it says mess you're gonna hit a B minor when you mess with a C goes to the next verse verse three okay so let's go over the chorus again i'm gonna just play it really slow and i'm gonna say the chords okay c d g f sharp seven c d g f sharp seven B minor C B minor D Gamma Ole Gamma Ole Gamma Ole Gamma Ole same chords over and over again right it's just gonna go B minor which you already learned D okay so for a D to a G 
Okay, so we got B minor for a D G back to D. I lost my Okay, so on E7, okay? Last chord that you're gonna have to learn and the last chord of the song, okay? All you're doing is index finger on the... Man, I'm definitely a little bit out of tune, guys. I'm sorry about that, but... Put your fingers where I'm telling you to go and if you're tuned up, it's gonna sound good for you. Bro, my alarm literally just went off because I gotta go to jiu-jitsu, so it stopped filming, but uh, I know we were on the bridge. So, B minor. <laughs> So that's three chords right there. B minor, D, G. Okay, now it's gonna go back to D. I lost my G. Back to D. I lost myself. Oh yeah, E7. So it goes to E7 right there. That's the last chord. E7 is on the uh, first fret of the... Uh, man, I should have tuned up whenever whenever it stopped filming. Should have tuned up for real. My bad. Uh, first fret, G string. Second fret, A string. That's your E7. Then it just repeats. B minor. Or a D. Schwartz. He's so good at that. Y'all know Marty Schwartz. He'd be doing his thing, singing the, singing the, singing the chords. Marty Schwartz, the GOAT! <sighs> That's it, guys. I mean, this is probably one of my longest videos, but if you if you really love this song, I know you're still watching because you're dedicated and you really want to learn it because it's a beautiful song, beautiful band. Marty Schwartz is a beautiful man. <laughs>